He's been called a small dog with big ideas. The Welsh Terrier. References to a good black and red terrier are found in Welsh chronicles of the mid-15th century. And the Welsh Terrier was among the first group of dogs for whom standards were written in the late 1800s. Welsh Terriers were first imported to the United States in 1886 and they've held a strong position ever since as show ring favorites. You'll be seeing many Welsh Terriers during this program. Some are outstanding examples of the breed, others are less so. But all of them will help your understanding of the Welsh Terrier. The Welsh Terrier is a sturdy, compact, rugged dog, medium-sized, with a coarse, wire-textured coat. The legs, underbody, and head are tan, while the jacket is black or occasionally grizzle. He's a no-frills sort of dog, built for action, but with a calm, intelligent air. He's famous for his alert, outgoing expression and friendliness with people. He has been called the best-tempered of all the terrier family and is equal to any terrier in watchfulness, loyalty, gameness, and alertness. The Welsh Terrier's muzzle is one half the length of the entire head, measured from tip of nose to occiput. This dog's muzzle is of proper length measured from the slight stop to the nose and is properly squared off. Notice how the furnishings on the muzzle are trimmed to complete, but not exaggerate, the rectangular outline as called for in the standard. There is a distinct Welsh Terrier expression. It comes in part from the somewhat broad back skull and properly placed eyes. Eyes are small and almond-shaped as seen here, and are placed fairly far apart. They are dark brown in color. The small size, almond shape, wide placement, and dark color are crucial to the correct Welsh expression. Proper ears are another critical component of the correct Welsh Terrier expression. Ears are V-shaped, small, but not too thin. Notice how the fold is just above the top line of the skull, as specified in the standard. They are carried forward, close to the cheek. The tips fall to or toward the outside corners of the eyes as the dog is at rest, moving slightly up and forward when at attention. The Welsh Terrier's coat is a double one, with dense, wiry furnishings on muzzle, legs, and quarters. The outer coat is hard, wiry, and dense, with a close-fitting, thick jacket. The undercoat is short and soft. The Welsh Terrier's coat color is black and tan. The tan is a deep reddish-brown. Slightly lighter shades are acceptable, as stated in the standard. The legs, quarters, and head are clear tan. The jacket is black, spreading up onto the neck, down onto the tail, and into the upper thigh. Instead of the completely black jacket we've just described, you may see grizzling like this. A grizzle jacket is also acceptable according to the standard. The Welsh Terrier is an extremely versatile dog. Friendly, outgoing and playful. But serious and eager when it comes to work. He's won the hearts of many thousands and will no doubt continue to do so for years to come. <laughs>